Vietnam is a figure that's a, a, a complicated one for 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 many. I think for many in the history of the Vietnam War, uh, Diem is simply seen as a as a sort of puppet of the of of the American government, and in some ways that is true. Uh, but I just wanted to point out that there there is a sort of growing historiography about Diem. Uh, this book, Miss Alliance, uh, by Edward Miller, No Din Diem, The United States and the Fate of South Vietnam, got a lot of attention um, a few years back when we were. Uh, working on the New York Historical Society exhibition, we were trying to figure out, you know, how to portray Diem uh, as something more than just this puppet figure, something more complicated. Uh, and it is a complicated story. And so I encourage you, if you're interested in Diem, uh, to check out some of these books. Um, here's another one, Cauldron of Resistance by Jessica Chapman. No Din Diem, the United States and 1950s Southern Vietnam. Uh, you know, all of uh, these recent books, I think, are interested in recovering a more complex vision of who Diem was, uh, a kind of uh, a, a mixture of a, a, a person who ha had a mixture of many different political and ideological and religious traditions going on, Confucianism, Catholicism. Uh, but for me, um, and for the purposes of NOM TV, I, I think what's most important uh, is that Diem was an anti-communist and that he was only in charge of South Vietnam uh, be when, he, when he had utility for the United States in their anti-communist project. And when he no longer had that utility, Diem was gone and Diem was dead. And we're going to get to a little of that today. So I, I want to I share uh, a few different excerpts um, from, from Marilyn Young as we begin here. And we're going to hear from uh, a few different figures today. Marilyn Young, I want to uh, hear a little bit from Malcolm Brown uh, and a little bit from Francis Fitzgerald's Fire in the Lake. I think all these three pieces that I've selected uh, will give us a, 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 a picture that I, I think is a, a pretty clear outline of, of, of this period and what's important about it. And, and I invite you always to sort of use NOM TV as, a, as an entryway into the stuff that interests you because these are all... To me, these are all rabbit holes, and it, I know there are some graduate students uh, or, or uh, aspiring graduate students watching this or listening to this. I, I try to offer, on Nostalgia Trap and NOM TV, you know, pieces of, uh, of, of research or, 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 or portals into areas of, of research that might be great dissertations or books or, or something like that. I don't know if they would be, but they're certainly intriguing directions. 